Hello YouTubers, welcome back to Yorkshire Media One. I am Mark. Hi, I'm Jen. And we are better and cheaper than the BBC. So what have we got for you today? Well, I thought I'd do a film review, so it's going to be a film, you know, Wednesday's film review. And I thought I'd review, we thought we would review this, Britannic. Oh, a lot of people may not have heard of the film and things like that. Um, this one's in two different languages and that, you know what I mean? But it was a good watch. So, so we shall begin. So on the opening, it sees, it sees Britannic, you see it being built, launched, and then you see scenes of World War One and things like that. That's where Britannic as an hospital ship operated around in that. So you saw all that in black and white. You saw the boat launched and to a cheer and things like that and then when the film gets going properly you see an opening shot where they're on a launch some passengers are on a launch and going towards Britannic and a little kid just say oh wow look at the ship you know you see Britannic in all its glory in white and green as an hospital ship because that's what it was and and that and then it goes on to the ship where you see people getting ready to depart and things like that and then there's a woman what's supposed to be a governess of this rich woman and that wants to talk to the captain on his own there you go with the other his second in command gives him a letter saying secret top secret and this is where the captain finds out that this governess is secret intelligence officer um tells the captain that they suspect a spy on board don't they yes they suspect that there's a spy on board and they she basically wants to find them doesn't she yeah she wants to find them and also the, there is a scene where britannic officer does get killed um or supposed to be a britannic officer, which it isn't we do know it's and it's a secret intelligence officer um the woman is the second one who had to be put on that last minute because he were found dead and things like that. And it starts off from there. And we know right from the beginning who the spy is, but she doesn't. And it, 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 it's quite intriguing to how it breaks out and things like that. And how things happen on Britannic. But I must admit, it's not as actual, factual as it could be. Um, and things like that, so that's what they do. But Jen's got the main point, so there you go. Over it's definitely you. not a hundred percent accurate, obviously, because we know how the Britannic actually did sink. Sink. But this film went from the family boarding the ship, like Mark said about, and this young girl being the governess to the children, her being secret intelligence because. They thought there's that they were looking for a spy on board. Um, the Britannic is bigger, and they they said she was unsinkable as well, just like the Titanic. Yeah, it was a sister ship. They they're saying she was a lot bigger, and that the bulkheads went higher than the Titanic, like five depths. Five, above. yeah, 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 yeah. 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 So Britannic's uh, watertight doors and decking. Went five decks. Her bulkheads went five decks higher than Titanic's. Yeah. Um, when you look at Britannic, she is a, 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 a bigger ship. She's definitely massive. she's massive. And this was based in nineteen sixteen, like Mark said, during the World First War World War. Um, when the German spy was doing his SOS to not SOS Morse code. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Morse. To <laughs> the U boat. The German U boat that was stalking them. That's the bit what's not. He factual. was like saying that she she was carrying ammunitions, not medical equipment like that they said that she was supposed to be carrying. And that they were gonna hijack the ship yeah. to take over the ammunitions to stop them getting to where they were going, basically. Which that plot it all fell apart, didn't it? Very quick. It definitely it, it fell, fell, apart. fell apart very quickly. Because the um the guy who we know who 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 was the spy is the priest. 
he goes down, gets the weapons and things like that. And while he's doing that, they're taking over, or trying to take over the rest of the ship with the guns and things like that. And that's where the uh, secret intelligence officer, the woman, uh, says, no, this is not right. And, and she mm -hmm. gets her gun out and she goes chasing. There is gunfire. Um, the priest, when he comes along, the spy in cell, he hears gunfire, but he holds back. And I thought, oh, well, this is going to be intriguing. And she kills uh, a bloke who were trying to take over and saves the captain and things like that. But they don't know who the spy is. At, at, at this moment in time, they definitely don't know who the spy is. But someone, I think it's a ship's doctor who comes up to him and says, whoever's killed, killed some, you know, this bloke, Stoker, and I, he needed him in coal, has uh, lost a button. And, the, and it's a crew button. It's from the tunic. She... she <laughs> She ends in his, and and she finds out who it is uh, by sleeping with him, basically. But yeah, there's a bit in it where you see the HMS Victoria. Yeah. And that's what ruins their first plan because they they torpedo the the U boat torpedoes Britannics by sending two torpedoes. Yeah. yeah. HMS Victoria. Death charges. Sends down death charges and totally wipes out the U boat. Yeah. And. The second in command on Britannic actually shoots at the second torpedo, yeah. and it the torpedo attack f failed completely. It did. It, so it did. It completely failed. And then the next scene he sees the ship docked, uh, ship docked in Naples and things like that. Yeah, 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 docked and things like that. And yeah, yeah, crew and passengers are going round and and that. Uh, going to church, um, you see the secret intelligence officer there, and then she sees the priest. So she says, "Oh," and she tried to catch him up. Then she holds back and sees that he's talking to a German, another German officer, who gives him a paper with, and it's got contact detonators in it. And he says, "I think you'll find a use for them," and that's it. And um, so he's hand over that, and then when she pops out and says, "Oh, I'll, I'll, I'll be looking for you," is that today's paper? He says yes. She texts it. There's no detonators there, obviously, and she says, "Oh, do you read Italian newspapers?" And then he speaks to her in, in Italian. So a very good spy at the, exactly, the moment because that makes her think he's not the spy. Yeah, exactly. That's why she obviously gives herself to him later in the film. Because she doesn't know he's the spy right till after she's given herself to him. That's it. So when she does eventually sleep with him, she finds out that he's got a missing button on his tunic. And she were called, but that alerts him in, in any case. And that, so, that's a key to it, really. After when she sleeps with me, that 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 is the biggest key. Yeah, I think. exactly. And she goes to the doctor because it's only the doctor and her that knows about this missing button. And so she it, goes to tell him. Yeah, she tells the doctor, and the doctor says, "Well, I, well, we need to speak to him." And he's and he, he comes in right behind her with gun and everything, and asks the doctor, "Where do you keep your ether?" And the doctor gets a gun, tries to shoot him, and he gets shot dead. And then she fights with him. Gets knocked out, or supposedly he thinks she's dead, and that he gets the ether and goes to the bow. It's down to the bowels of the ship, and that, and she comes to, picks up a gun, and she goes, and she can follow him because very, I mean, it, it, it's it, it's a good idea to leave markers, and his hand is cut, blood. And you can see blood all well. So she follows it, the trail. And when she gets down there, she comes up on him when he's putting the detonators into this bottle of ether. And then she says, stop, don't move, put the bottle down and everything. And he says, shoot me or not. And the boat's still going to sink. And that. Now, she does shoot him. And she shoots the, she shoots the bottle out of his hand. And it goes flying. And 
it lands on it lands that way up where the detonators are so it blows up and it, it supposedly to blow an hole in the side of the ship which it did and that and that's the young factual part of this because we all know botanic got it by a mine and it went down by a mine and it took well in the film it takes 57 minutes but in reality 55 minutes mm -hmm. so that's the young but it's a good storyline i think if it had been a better director, I think the storyline could have been a hell of a lot better. I think if someone like James Cameron did it, I think he'd include the mine, so it's factual, like Titanic, but with a made-up story. Yeah. And that's what Britannic is. I mean, don't forget, you know, she's hell picking up these, you know, soldiers who were injured in World War and taking them back to England and things like that. But the, this is a made-up story, but it's a very good one. And Definitely. it's got some decent actors in it. It's got Edward Atterton in it, Amanda Ryan, Jacqueline Bisset, Rice Davis and Bruce Payne. John Rice Davis and Bruce Payne. And also so, some um, Ben Adams as well. Yeah, and Ben Adams is in it. Um, I was quite surprised to see as many British actors and American actors in this. And that, but it is a good film. But unfortunately, our copy, we have to have it in. It's in French. It's in French, and then we have to put it to English. So, but it, you can get it. You can get it on Amazon. It's there. It's cheap enough as well. It's about four, yeah, we have, we've re, we have recently looked, and it's about what four, about four, four, four or five pounds, um, something like that. So it, you can get it, but it's the first time I've ever seen a film about Britannic. It Made really is. It, it really yeah. is, and that. And obviously, we're not going to tell you how the film ends, like what happens to their story, like yeah, the yeah. Well, that's where we're going to. Well, that. well, that's where we leave it. So, what whatever happened to the spy or her, uh, you're going to have to watch the film to uh, see what it is. But I enjoyed it. It, it was it's an not, enjoyable it wasn't film. It was a bad film. It was. It's okay. It's a good film. And with them um, having. Them many amount of actors in it, especially Jackie. Uh, Jackie Bissett. Yeah, especially we are in it. it. It's unbelievable. Look, it's a good film. It really is a good film. There is a factual part in it, but I'm not going to tell you which it is. So there you go. But you know, it's definitely how, how the ship watch. sinks is unfactual. He didn't hit a mine in this film. Mm. He, he blew up with a bottle of ether. <laughs> Sunk with a bottle of ether, but. It is what it is. Now, is this a keeper? I think it is a keeper. Would we watch it again? I'd, it's definitely watchable. It, you would watch it again, wouldn't you? I mean, there will be parts of this film, what we have missed. I mean, when you first watch a film and you watch it for a second, a second or a third time, you do see things what you haven't seen before. Um, so, it is a keeper. It will be going into a collection. And, and yes, we will watch it again. It's as simple as that. As soon as I can get it into it, you know, fully English, I will do that. But for now, they've got this. So this is Britannic. And, and it's a very good film. And we did promise that we'd do a film review together, didn't we? Yes, and we have done, as you can see. So that's <laughs> our film review together. Hopefully you've liked it like this film review and if you do like the film you can get it on amazon i haven't seen it anywhere else i haven't even seen it in cex i haven't seen, seen, it, seen anywhere. it anywhere else but on the amazon so go to amazon you can get the french version but there is a british version, version on amazon yeah. as well yeah because we have ordered the english version which wasn't there when i originally got this one this was the only one that was there originally yeah but this was second hand wasn't it mm -hmm. it wasn't new was it no, it was the used section on Amazon, so... Sure. Yeah, right, but it's right. a good copy, so... It is. It is a good copy. And it's a very good film. Like I say, the plot is OK. They could have done better, I suppose. They could have made it a little bit better than that in, in, in parts. But apart from that, it's a good watchable, it's a good story. And like we said, we would, we did promise to do a film review together because somebody asked us to do it together, so that's what we did. And I chose this film, you know, because with two of us, if I don't remember, Jen's written down... A few bits. A, f a few bits what is the main thing, isn't it? Yeah. Really. Where it all happened and that. 
Just little bits and bobs. Yeah. <laughs> so there you go. So, Britannic. So, if you like this review and you want to go get the film, get the film, buy the film. It, it, I do recommend it for a good watch. It really is. And that. But um, a lot of people, when they found out that they could get this, is it better than Titanic? No. I don't no. think it is. I, th I think it's way behind Titanic. It's, but it's definitely it's, its own story, isn't it? It is. It is. But it is what it is. So, like I said, it will be staying in our collection. And it's as simple as that. So, if you've liked this, please give us a thumbs up. Please like. Please subscribe if you're new. Hit the bell icon on it all. That will let you know when we're putting up another video. Or when I'm putting up another video. And also share the video to your friends and your family and to other social media like X, Facebook, Instagram, Twitch and also use the comment section below. We do try and answer all comments as much as we can. Let us know if you've actually seen the film yourself. If you've seen this film, which I don't know if many... If you've seen this film, let us know what you think to it. Exactly. It's as simple as that. And all there is to say now is we'll see you on the next video. Bye. 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 Now, catch your waiter. Bye.